summer weather may have us moving a little slow, but four action movies coming up will get that heart pounding again. Movies bringing the heat on the hot list. Showtime. Oh my God. It's Showtime. The first action movie on our list, Mission Impossible Fallout. Go, 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 go. What are you waiting for? I'm jumping out a window. Oh, sorry, good luck. Tom Cruise, or maybe we should call him Tom Crazy, is back and raising a ruckus in his sixth mission, doing stunts himself that most other actors wouldn't dream of taking on. You're talking about Tom jumping out of a plane that's traveling at 165 miles an hour, falling at 200 miles an hour. I can't wait for an audience to see this. The movie, if you choose to see it, is in theaters tomorrow. <laughs> What are you doing? I find it best not to look. If you're looking for an action movie that also packs in some laughs, you might enjoy The Spy Who Dumped Me at number two. Oh my god, I killed someone! I killed someone! Stop yelling that! In theaters next Friday, Mila Kunis and SNL's Kate McKinnon play best friends in way over their heads after Mila's ex turns out to be a spy involved in some pretty serious stuff. <laughs> Some bad people are after me, and now they're after you. Simple enough. See the pair go from zeros to heroes as they travel to Europe to take on the bad guys. I have a real instinct for this. I do play a lot of video games. Two weeks after that movie's release, we'll see two more action flicks on the big screen. First, let's check out Mile 22 at number three. According to the government, we do not exist for ghosts. We are very real. Mark Wahlberg, fighting champ Ronda Rousey, and John Malkovich star in this thriller about CIA operatives on a dangerous mission to keep someone with valuable information safe. The goal is deliver that package to here, mile 22. Sounds easy enough, but spoiler alert, it won't be. It's in theaters August 17th. Fast forward, freeze frame on my pistol. Pray. You're chaos. I think I might be worse. I am a killer who looks like a hero. Pray, pray. Also in theaters that weekend, we go back to the Ice Age with Alpha at number four. A young man is injured and left to die, but he's got a lot of fight left, especially when he teams up with a lone wolf who was, like him, abandoned by his pack. Likely allies take on countless dangers and overwhelming odds to find their way home before a deadly winter arrives. Big movies bringing even bigger action on the hot list.